Look at you shopping. Yeah. Huh? Amazing, Mura. Finally. Finally. First yeah. shop. First shop, yeah. Got the mask on. We're finally out of lockdown. <laughs> nice to get out. Yeah, so nice. It's a very quiet uh, day. You know, in the last vlog, you got lots of compliments for being an amazing cook. <laughs> there were people who were impressed with your food you were making. Yes, yeah. Makes me happy. They wanted to know whether you had official training. No. Not? No. Self-taught, huh? finished our first shop and uh, these things are horrible these masks uh, I know they are helpful to wear but you feel like you're suffocating but that's the way it is so put that over there Now we go and shop some paper. I'm so very warm. So we need some paper for printing and we need yeah. to uh, some find paper. some elderflower blossoms. Yeah. yeah. Well, Mr. Penelope, how many weeks since he's been driven? Yeah, well, two months, I would say. Lovely 25 degrees. And uh, <laughs> you, look very, I, you look very cute yeah, to that I'm going to jump out just now, so I just leave it on. Look at that. We have our own tennis oh, courts yeah. here in this little village. Anyway, here we go. My goodness me, it's nice and warm. Yeah. Open the window. Yeah, look Can you believe it? Yeah, that was a good shop. Mm -hmm. uh, not too busy. Nah, very nice actually. Fully stocked. I think it's really nice when you go in the middle of the week actually. Right. Now we turn in here, let's see that I can go to the paper. Okay. We need to get the bicycle tires pumped. Yeah, that's a nice yeah. It's really nice because I mean there's a little bit of people, not too many, but a little bit of people around. Normally it's crowded here. Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. But not now. No one came for the yeah. apricot blossoms because of the no. lockdown, so yeah. nobody came. Yeah. Normally this little place is overcrowded, the whole Vachau Valley has Thousands, literally tens of thousands of people from Austria alone who come and... Uh, Let's see there, in the front. In the front? Yeah, yeah that, where the paper is. Is that the paper shop? I don't know, I think so. I don't know. I think so. I'll pull it here. Over there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to 
Well done. You got the paper? Yes. We stopped on the side of the road and saw these elderflower bushes in the farmyard. And my girl jumped out quickly and asked the farmer whether we could come and pick some of these blossoms. And he said, with pleasure. So what's the game plan? How do we make elderflower cordial? I need 30 of those. Ah, oh, you need 30 what? Blossoms. Put it. How do you call it? We set it in cold. That means we don't put, um, we don't heat it up. We just make it all cold. Mm -hmm. Gonna put two and a half liters in. This the one is very funny because it only goes to 750. Ah. Oh, not oh, 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 oh. <laughs> So, and then half a liter. to all be under the water. I'll put the lemons in the water. It smells amazing. Yeah, this is fantastic. Sorry, dear viewers, we don't do smell vision yet. Otherwise, you'd be like, mmm, this is heavenly. Whoa, it smells mm -hmm. fantastic. And, that, and the trick on this recipe is that you put it cold there for 24 hours. Now, it's, it has to stand in the room. It's not cold. You not put sugar in yet? No, no sugar. For 24 hours, no sugar, just like this. So you just, you just, Perfuming the water. Now I'm thinking if I can do this, you think? Voila! Okay, <laughs> so that's how it stays now. Oh, 24 plan. hours. And we have a second pot for the second <laughs> feeling it's easier at the end of this very nice process we are now doing the final the mint we already poured put in too much I just don't want it to be so heavy when I pour it you know Production line going here. Yeah. <laughs> some of the good stuff. How many days did you have this? 24 uh, hours. You have to. 24 hours for the sugar to dissolve because it's never heated. That's perfect timing. Look at that. Well, I 
This is a special mint liqueur, homemade. We've taken elderflower blossoms from the yeah. from, from in the mountains. We have taken 30, 30, 30 blossoms. Then you put in two and a half liters of water. And uh, one lemon and one orange. You just left it for 24 hours. But it has to be how do you call it, covered? Yep. Covered that it does that the blossoms are in the water. Make sure the blossoms and the lemon the pieces are all yeah. submerged beneath the, the, yes. the top layer of the water. And then you take it, you take it through a sieve, and then you put the sugar in for two and a half liters. It's two and a half, um, two and a half kilograms of sugar, and and then you must stir the sugar, and it dissolves within 24 hours. So this one is never boiled. You put in a little bit for the taste, and they say 70 grams of corn and soy there. There you go, ladies and gentlemen, a simple elderflower cordial recipe. Hope you try it at home. Thanks for watching. It's been wonderful hanging out with you guys. And until next Sunday, from me, Rory Ali, lots of love. Ciao for now.